Hello, good afternoon. This is uh, David Soto talking to you, and today I'm excited to announce the release of my new Excalibur Expert Advisor, or EA for short, okay? In this video, I simply want to show you uh, how it works, show you some results, etc., to you know, give you a little proof of how it works. I'm going to explain the strategy a bit and just uh, show you the basics of this. And uh, in the next video, in a subsequent video, I'm going to show you step by step how to install it, okay? So, without further ado, this expert advisor is based upon my Excalibur trend indicator, which everybody's been using for the last several months and having great success with. But everybody could be asking me, can you please turn this into an EA, make this an auto trading function? Okay, and that is very, very difficult to do because the indicator alone, you cannot use just the indicator to make an expert advisor. Okay, it's not going to have you. It's not going to create long-term results, long-term success. Okay, so <clears throat> what I needed to do was develop a set of rules for entry that would go along with my indicator and would give you a great success. All right, that's a very, very difficult task to do. Plus, I already have an expert advisor that I've been using for the past year that has been working very well. My ultimate EA. All right, my ultimate EA has been working very well. People have been using this and have great success with it. So I wanted to make something that was even better than before. So to outdo, outperform my previous EA was an even greater task, a greater challenge for me. Okay. But you know, I finally have come down to a set of rules for entry, and that was the biggest challenge, really. So basically, how this works, okay is if you get a if I use the Excalibur trend indicator okay I'm just going to show you this real quick if I use my Excalibur trend indicator and I get a signal to buy for example like right here okay with this right here when this arrow goes up all right by two candles all right when you when it goes up and the second candle is bigger than this previous candle that's the time it wants to place a trade okay and by default I have a 25 point take profit so it will be able to get in and out very quickly okay and as long as the conditions are right it will continue to place more additional trades it can place up to by default now by default it will place a maximum of five trades okay but it will not place all five trades at once okay it'll place a trade wait for another appropriate condition and then place another trade so it may be 30 minutes in between trades it may be a few hours in between trades just depends on what time frame you're using okay uh, I designed this by default to be using a five minute chart okay so you get a high frequency of trades now the, the downside of this is you might have some trades that are stuck open for a long time and can cause some serious drawdown right if you use a small time frame uh, do not use a one minute chart all right it's I had some really bad results on one minute chart but I wanted to show you uh, results on a 30 minute chart okay I've tested different time frames and for me personally I like using a 30 minute chart with uh, about a 50 point take profit okay so if you look on this graph down here all right I ran a back test using test data that is 99 point nine percent accurate okay it's provided by a company called Ducas copy and the test data is very very accurate okay so I know these results are pr what you should expect in a live account in a real world scenario but if you see here on this graph okay there are some areas where it dropped this is not a stop loss being hit okay this is simply a drawdown and you had swap fees that were greater than your take profit all right you're greater than your actual profit so the trade actually lost money because of the swap fees now you could actually if you, this is only going by the default 25 point take profit so if you have a higher take profit like 100 points or 150 points your drawdown won't be so bad all right and your swap fees won't be so bad so your your, your graph will probably look different than this but I just want to use the basic default settings just like anybody else would 
and to show you and give you an illustration of what to expect all right now if we look at the report all right if we look at the report here we have a 95.93 percent accuracy rate and about a four percent uh, loss rate okay that's very very good now if you look at the drawdown right here okay relative drawdown you have a 55 percent drawdown okay maximum drawdown now a 55 percent drawdown seems very high I agree but that's having five trades open at a time also so if you divide 55 by 5 you get a roughly 11 percent drawdown which is really not bad at all so please do keep in mind that your drawdown is affected by the number of trades you have open all right so by by the default sentence this will place five up to five trades at a time per currency pair or per chart so if you have 10 charts open 10 currency pairs you could potentially have uh you know 10 times five which is 50 trades open at one time all running negative and if you don't have if you have a large lot size and you don't have a big enough account balance you could you could potentially blow your account all right so with a stop loss the only thing you're going to do is lose money with a stop loss if it's hit too many times you will blow your account as well so the greatest protection with this or any other system you ever use is good money management and by that I mean using a small lot size compared to your account balance so in the beginning I would probably recommend a 0 0.01 lot size for every $500 that you have in your account if that makes sense okay so you can use a bigger lot size I don't care the default lot size is a 0 0.1 or 0 0.10 lot size and that may be too big for you all right I tested this with a $500 account balance and it worked fine but then again you know you may not be comfortable with that you may want to start smaller I would start with a 0 0.01 or even like 0 0.05 just to play it safe okay if you run this for a few weeks and you're having phenomenal results and you're making a lot of money then why not increase your lot size to a 0 0.10 0 0.12 whatever but don't go crazy all right don't do like a 1.0 lot size because you could you'll still you'll you know you just run a very very strong chance of blowing your account okay and i don't want to see you lose money you're here to make money okay you're not here to lose all your money so this is not like going to a casino or you know this is not just press a button and make a ton of money all right you need to use good money management but I want to kind of show you the results that this has happened also if you look at my Facebook group okay if you look here in my Facebook group I'm going to show you my Facebook group wherever it is uh, hold on I had it open okay sorry if I go to my Facebook group here you can see a lot of people having great success with it all right uh, this guy has on a live account won a bunch of trades made ten dollars in one night that's not bad right and uh, this guy Oliver has been using on day three had a four percent drawdown uh, he switched to a 50 minute chart he wasn't a five minute so he's still having great results okay and he's running on a live account uh, this guy Dan has been testing for the last seven hours has $16 profit so that's pretty good right having great success uh, test EA uh, day one of testing the new EA very impressed so people are having really really good results of this all right so I just want to kind of show you you know real proof that people are having great success with this if you are not a part a member of my Facebook group please uh, click the link below in the description of this video that way you can join my Facebook group and you can share your results and look at other people's results as well and uh, join the discussion for this okay but I just want to kind of show you the results that I'm having and that you can expect with this EA okay I've already run this on a live account and also I've been running this on a demo account just testing different time frames and so far it's just it's working phenomenal okay and I'm gonna give regular updates on how this works and I'm gonna probably show other people's results as well okay so with that said I want to end this video but in the next video I'm gonna show you step-by-step step how to install this okay so just uh, 
please reach out to me on Facebook if you do not have a demo copy and we'd like to test this all right I can give you a one week demo trial version that you can test this and you know use on different time frames or different take profits and see you know what kind of results you're going to get with this okay so with that said just uh, let me know if you have any questions contact me on Facebook there's a link below in the description of this video for my personal Facebook account okay you can contact me there or also there's a link for my private Facebook group if you have not joined my Facebook group just uh, please join join my Facebook group this way you can uh, ask any questions or post any results or share you know share experiences with others and share other people's experiences as well okay so with that said just let me know if you have any questions and I'll be more than happy to help you okay thank you and have a wonderful day